you ain't gonna find thirty of horses and leads in all of New Austin. you better off not knowing. You don't look much like no blackboarder, fella. That's because I ain't. If I'm being honest, I don't care much for those high pollutant and big city types. Not much at all. Blackwater ain't much of a city. More of a town with delusions, but no, me neither. He was out in Blackwater a few months back and saw one of them newfangled carriages without horses. Is that so? Hey, you wind him up like a clock. Everything he ever saw without the aid of liquor, he told me. Times are changing fast. That's for sure. Concern yourself with. Never you mind all my questions, Mr. Marston. I just reckon you might be barking out of not heading for the fort. We'll see when we get there. But I sure as hell ain't sticking around. Fort Mercer ain't no place for an old man like me to be a dawdling around. Yeah. You look like a man with a lot on his mind, Mr. Marston. So I won't bother you none with my chatter. I'll tell you, Mr. Marston, those coyotes eat better than I do. <laughs> Almost there, Mr. Marston, just over this hill. Come on. Listen, mister, this heat... Come on! Figured it's about time I started paying back that 
Well, no time to waste. The horses are saddled up over here. There's the foreman's office. It's also where we lock up good-for-nothing outlaws, such as yourself. I'm happy enough with my current quarters right now, Miss McFarland. Okay, let's see if you can still ride a horse. Come on, time for you to see what a real ranch looks like. Let's go! is the general store. You won't find Parisian high fashion, but it's good for the essentials. Very convenient. I don't think I've ever seen a ranch with its own store before. And here's the corral. This one's for the horses. What do you think? I'm no expert, but it certainly looks like a fine corral. I suspect you've stolen more horses than you've broken. Now, where'd you get such an idea? Come on, Mr. Marston, pick up the pace! Whoa! head out on patrol. You'll get no complaints from me, Miss McFarlane. Whoa there. Come on. Come on, this is the only chance you're gonna get to rest. cold drink, Mr. Mark. Come on, then. Let's mount up and take a look around. Right. Follow me. Keep your eyes peeled for anything suspicious. Marston, I feel a lot happier someone's along with me. I feel a lot happier now I got a rifle. Well, with your trigger itch and my feminine intuition, we should make quite a team. I don't believe it. Those damn rabbits are back. Give me a hand with them, will you? Them rabbits can be wily little critters. 
Let's mount up and patrol the rest of the property. off the land like this. Maybe you should move to a big city. Become a lady of leisure. Yeah! Was that a coyote? Get those pets before they scare the livestock! Come on! can actually handle a rifle. It's something I've had a little experience in. Maybe Bill Williamson did get lucky after all. Luck didn't really come into it, miss. You're a useful man to have around the ranch, that's for sure. But don't think I've forgotten what brought you here. We'll do whatever we can to help you. I sure appreciate that, Miss McFarland. This is you, Mr. Marston. Mr. Marston. Makes me kind of happy I saved your life. Get some sleep and I will see you in the morning. Good night, Miss McFarlane. 